All right, in the middle of a chest and tricep workout right now, and I figured this would be a good time to kind of give you uh, some first-hand experience of what my anxiety in the gym looks like. I'm in here in my gym. Um, it's a private facility where I usually used to do all my content, to do my training for one-on-one -on -one clients, and to do any group training and whatnot. I made a post about this, I think a couple weeks ago. Um, Sorry, I just finished the set, so I'm a little out of breath. Um, so, I haven't went through much gym anxiety in a while. Uh, it's kind of hit or miss. Today it's been bugging me a lot because I'm really congested, and uh, I don't know if it's allergies, I don't know if it's a sinus infection, I don't know exactly what it is, but I keep feeling pressure all along. I know what it is, I know it's something with my sinuses, but someone that's an anxiety disorder or panic, that has a panic disorder, um, even if you don't, I mean, you know, if you have anxiety in general, it can kind of bother you and irritate you and you can kind of think the worst. You're like, all right, I'm working out, I'm getting lightheaded a lot easier, um, it's hard to breathe, whatever. You instantly think of, all right, well, what could be wrong? And in reality, there's really nothing wrong. Um, it's just your anxiety really picking up on a page where it's like, all right, let's try to find what might be wrong with our body right now. Uh, you know, the heart okay? It'll start to self-analyze itself, which uh, that's your body's job, but when your mind is running anxiously wild, it sucks because your brain kind of takes over and is like, well, your body is kind of saying your, your heart's beating a lot faster, you're just chilling there, or you're having a hard time breathing, or you're keeping these tingles and sensations in your head. So it's really easy, um, as you can see, for anxiety to really pick up in uh, instances like that. So one thing I try to do, or a couple things I try to do to help, is uh, I'll take it a little slow if I'm feeling a little anxious. Uh, I won't get right back into things. I'll take a little bit longer rest. I'll make sure I have some nice cold water with me so I can kind of put it on pressure points, whether it's my forehead, if I'm having different pressures in my head, like right now because of my sinuses. You can put it on your wrist, by your chest, like I said, different pressure points like that will actually help calm the heart rate down a little bit better. Um, not only for anxiety, but for in the gym. Um, obviously, be drinking the water too. Uh, it's gonna help as well, hydrate your, uh, hydrate your body. Um, I think I put something about this somewhere else. Sometimes, if it gets to the point where like, I just need a quick distraction from my mind, I'll pop something sour in my mouth, like the icebreakers, or I'll pop some gum in my mouth, um, something like that. Uh, sometimes I have the lavender, I don't have it on me right now, it's over there, but like the lavender essential oils, I made a post about all this. Again, those are the these are the times I'll use techniques like that to uh, try to help myself calm down in the gym. And like I said, there's, it's not like there's anyone else in here, so I know this is a little bit harder if you're in a public gym. Uh, I remember I would use to just, again, I would use some of these different techniques where I just take a break, you know, whether it's going to the lobby, uh, go outside, take a brisk walk around outside if it's nice out. Um, talk to one of my friends in the gym. Um, keep the water bottle handy. Keep it nice, like I said, the pressure points with the very cold water. That'll help calm, calm you down, cool you down a little bit. Um, so, but those are just some of the things that typically help me. Like I said, the things I'm going through today aren't the typical things, so I think that's why I'm thrown off a little bit. And already just talking about it uh, and letting my body kind of relax a little bit, I feel a lot better. So, I don't know. What is uh, some sensations and some anxiety things that you guys typically go through when you're in the gym? You know, I wanna hear your guys' feedback. You know, you don't have to put it in the comments. If you want to, you can just direct message me. Uh, I would love to kind of, you know, connect with you guys and get more opinions on, get more opinions on what you guys like to do if you're anxious in the gym. Um, and, you know, again, I kind of create this as a community, so I hope that if you do comment, you know, no one's judging you. I'm obviously very, very open and vulnerable with you guys, so I expect some of you guys to, uh, you know, be respectful to others, uh, you know. So, but yeah, I would love to hear what you guys do if, you, if you're anxious in the gym. What kind of sensations do you have? Do you have a fast heart rate, heart palpitations, uh, shortness of breath, uh, you know, so. But I'm gonna end the video here. I hope this helps you guys. Like I said, it helped me a little bit just to kind of calm my brain and realize what's actually going on and it's this pressure in my sinuses probably because of the allergies but uh, i hope this helps you guys and i will see you in the next video